Have you ever wondered what moments could shatter a hero, turning light into darkness? In the Star Wars universe, the story of Anakin Skywalker stands out as a profound tragedy, a clash between light and dark eventually forging him into Darth Vader. But which critical moments opened his path to the dark side? Join us today as we reveal the top 10 most humiliating moments that unraveled Anakin's destiny, turning him from a prophesized hero to the galaxy's most dreaded Sith Lord. Number 10. Killing Count Dooku The execution of Count Dooku marked a pivotal moment in Anakin Skywalker's journey towards the dark side. Under the heavy influence of Chancellor Palpatine, Anakin was persuaded to kill an unarmed Dooku, a direct contradiction to the Jedi Code he swore to uphold. This act was not just a moment of victory, but a profound humiliation, as it revealed the cracks in Anakin's adherence to the Jedi teachings and his internal moral compass. The seeds of doubt were sown, as Anakin grappled with the weight of his actions, questioning the very foundations of his identity as a Jedi. This moment was a harbinger of the darkness that lay ahead, illustrating the conflict between his loyalty to the Jedi and the seductive power of Palpatine's manipulation. Number 9. The Massacre of the Younglings The Massacre of the Younglings stands as one of the most harrowing and humiliating acts committed by Anakin Skywalker marking his irrevocable fall to the dark side. Ordered by Palpatine, Anakin's slaughter within the hallowed halls of the Jedi Temple not only extinguished innocent lives, but also symbolized the death of his own innocence as the final severance from the Jedi he once aspired to embody. This moment was a profound betrayal of everything Anakin was taught to protect and cherish, underscoring his complete surrender to Darth Sidious' will. The act was not just a physical massacre, but a spiritual humiliation. As Anakin's actions reflected his transformation from a guardian of peace into an agent of chaos, forever tarnishing his legacy and sealing his fate as a tragic Darth Vader. Number 8. Being Denied the Rank of Jedi Master Being denied the rank of Jedi Master was a public rebuke that deeply humiliated Anakin Skywalker. Despite his appointment to the Jedi Council at Chancellor Palpatine's request, the Council's refusal to grant him the rank of Master, a status he believed he had earned, stung with betrayal and disrespect. This moment was more than a personal affront. It was a stark reminder of the Jedi Council's distrust and underscored the growing rift between Anakin and the Order he had dedicated his life to serve. The frustration and humiliation Anakin felt were palpable, fueling his resentment and alienation from the Jedi. This denial not only questioned his value and achievements, but also played into Palpatine's manipulative hands, driving a wedge further between Anakin and the Jedi and pushing him closer to the dark side. Number 7. Forced Secrecy of His Marriage The forced secrecy of his marriage to Padme Amidala placed Anakin in an excruciating position, pitting his deepest love against the rigid doctrines of the Jedi Code. The Jedi's prohibition on attachments meant Anakin had to live a double life, isolating him from those he might have sought support from. This concealment was a constant source of tension and shame, undermining his standing among his peers and eroding his trust in the Order. The irony was palpable. The very institution that taught him about integrity and honesty compelled him to weave a web of lies. This duplicity not only distanced Anakin from his fellow Jedi, but also sowed the seeds of paranoia and fear of loss, emotions that the dark side would later exploit. The secrecy of his marriage was a symbol of his ongoing struggle between personal desire and duty, a battle that would eventually lead to his downfall. Number 6. Visions of Padme's Death Haunted by visions of Padme's death in childbirth, Anakin's psyche was tormented by a desperate need to alter fate. These premonitions mirrored the powerless agony he experienced with his mother's demise, intensifying his fear of losing another he could not live without. His frantic search for a way to save Padme drove him into the clutches of dark promises and questionable choices. Each vision was a cruel reminder of his past failures and current impotence, casting a shadow over his celebrated prowess as a Jedi. This emotional turmoil was not just a personal crisis, but a public spectacle of his unraveling, laying bare the vulnerabilities of the galaxy's greatest hero. Anakin's inability to protect those closest to him, despite his immense power, was a profound source of shame and a pivotal factor in his tragic turn towards the dark side, seeking a power the Jedi could not offer. Number 5. The Death of His Mother, Shmi Skywalker The death of Anakin's mother, Shmi Skywalker, was a defining moment of anguish and helplessness that deeply scarred him. 
rescuing her from the clutches of Tusken raiders only to have her die in his arms, Anakin's grief was compounded by a profound sense of failure. This loss was not just a personal tragedy. It was a public testament to his limitations, challenging the notion of the all-powerful Jedi Knight he aspired to be. The event marked a crucial turning point, igniting a simmering rage and a fear of loss that would come to dominate his actions. It was a humiliation in the most intimate sense, revealing his vulnerability to the world and to himself. This moment underscored the tragic paradox of the Anakin Skywalker. Despite his extraordinary abilities, he was powerless to save those he loved most, a realization that fueled his eventual surrender to the dark side in a misguided attempt to seize control over life and death. Number 4. Betrayal by the Jedi Council Anakin felt a deep sense of betrayal when the Jedi Council asked him to spy on Chancellor Palpatine, a man he considered not just a political ally, but a personal mentor and father figure. This request was a stark violation of his trust and loyalty, placing him in an untenable position between his allegiance to the Jedi Order and his friendship with Palpatine. It was a public humiliation, casting him as a pawn in the Council's political machinations, eroding his faith in the Jedi principles of honesty and integrity. This moment of betrayal exasperated Anakin's growing disillusionment with the Jedi, feeding into Palpatine's narrative of the Council's corruption and ambition. It marked a critical juncture in Anakin's journey, deepening his inner conflict and pushing him further towards the dark side, as he increasingly questioned the intentions and morality of the order he once revered. Number 3. Failure to Prevent Mace Windu's Death Anakin's role in the death of Mace Windu was a monumental act of betrayal against the Jedi Order, marking a point of no return on his path to the dark side. In choosing to save Palpatine, Anakin not only facilitated the demise of a key figure in the Jedi hierarchy, but also directly opposed the principles he had sworn to uphold. This act was a public declaration of his allegiance to Palpatine, cementing his fate as Darth Vader. The humiliation here was multifaceted. Anakin was humiliated by his own actions, which betrayed his former identity and ideals, and he was also humiliated in the eyes of the Jedi, as his betrayal was a clear abandonment of their code and trust. This moment was a final, irrevocable step into darkness, as Anakin chose the path of personal gain over collective moral duty, sealing his legacy as the betrayer of the Jedi Order. Number 2. Padme's Rejection on Mustafar Padme's rejection on Mustafar was a deeply personal humiliation for Anakin, severing the last ties to his former life and completing his transformation into Darth Vader. Witnessing the horror and rejection in Padme's eyes as she confronted the monster he had become was a devastating blow to Anakin's heart. This moment was not just a rejection by his beloved, but a mirror reflecting the dark path he had chosen, stripping away any remaining illusions of nobility or righteousness in his actions. The emotional turmoil of losing Padme's love and respect, coupled with his subsequent actions, underscored the complete annihilation of Anakin Skywalker's identity, leaving only the dark shell of Vader. This personal defeat marked the culmination of his journey to the dark side, a journey fueled by a twisted quest for power and control that ultimately led to his own undoing and the loss of everything he held dear. Number 1. Defeat by Obi-Wan Kenobi on Mustafar The defeat by Obi-Wan Kenobi on Mustafar represented both a physical and emotional nadir for Anakin Skywalker. This confrontation was not merely a duel between former friends. It was a tragic clash of ideals, marking the final collapse of Anakin's former self. Suffering severe injuries and left for dead by his mentor and brother-in-arms, Anakin's defeat was the ultimate humiliation. It was a stark testament to his failure not just as a Jedi, but as a man who had lost everything to the dark side. This moment encapsulated the complete destruction of his identity, ambitions, and the relationships that had once defined him. Left scarred and dependent on the machinery that kept him alive, Anakin's transformation into Darth Vader was complete. His defeat by Obi-Wan served as a painful reminder of the choices that led him to this desolate point, a physical manifestation of his internal turmoil and the dark path he had chosen. And there you have it, the heart-rending downfall of Anakin Skywalker, a journey from light to darkness marked by moments of profound humiliation and loss. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel and watch the next one.